DPP legislator Ye Yijing retracted her draft policy calling for subsidies of 3,000 a month for each child under the age of 18 in order to stimulate birth rates. The proposal had drawn controversy since being introduced last Friday. And Ye says she would remove the draft legislation today but promised to continue promoting it. DPP legislator Ye Jin has come under fire after she proposed a draft bill which would give all of the country's youth under the age of 18 a monthly subsidy of 3,000 NT. The country is financially strapped and it's been a trend to cut down these lump sum subsidies. The draft bill would cost 145 billion NT a year and will place a heavy burden on the nation's treasury. Some fear a more serious problem would be the distortion of youth's perception of money. Kids may start to develop the idea that they can reap benefits such as a 3,000 NT per month subsidy without having to do anything. Facing strong opposition from the public, yet decided to retract the proposal and plans to come up with another version with a lower subsidy amount. However, some experts are suspicious of her motives. Her move leads to speculation of potential vote buying. The bill is aimed at parents of these children as well as high school students who will soon be entitled to voting rights in the next few years. Rising criticism of the subsidy draft bill ultimately led yet to withdraw the bill or face even more opposition.